Hello everyone, today's topic is about create a new account book on auto count accounting. There are two ways to access create new account book, either by an existing account book or first time manage account book. Let's begin with scenario that have an existing account book. Login auto count with admin user ID or user ID with all access rights. Click file, then manage account book and create account book. Create account book wizard window will appear. In basic information, insert the company name in new company name column. The database name column will auto filled, the database name can be changed. Click the column of database folder to change the location to store database. In database server location, remain option create a default account book in this PC when you are using main PC to create new account book. Tick the second checkbox, create a new account book in any PC, when you are using another SQL instance, or, the current PC is a sub-PC. Remain option use default SA account, and password, when you are using auto count default settings. Tick the checkbox of use the following username and password, when you are using different settings. Click test connection, to confirm the connection is success. Then, click next to proceed. The next section contains start date, country, home currency, and tax. Start date allows to select fiscal year start date and actual data start date. Fiscal year start date is the specific start date of this account book. Actual data start date is the specific date of the actual data to start entry for this account book. By default the date will be in the 1st of January of current year. Insert the date, or, click down arrow, to change the start date. Next is country, click the get latest country, to get all countries in auto count. Click the down arrow, and, select the country. After you have selected a country, the currency setting in home currency will show up. By default the country's currency is selected, click others to select other currency. Continue to tax. Tick the checkbox to enable tax functions. Click next to continue. Last page contains account code format and sample chart of accounts. You are able to amend the account code format based on the tables or clear the column to use free format. L represents an uppercase alphabetic characters only. A represents an alphanumeric characters only. Zero represents a numeric characters. And, these for symbols are allowed to add in account code format. By default, the checkbox of create sample chart of accounts, is ticked. You are able to click the down arrow, to select types of companies. Tick the checkbox of copy master data from other account book, to copy from other existing account book. Untick the checkbox options, to not allow copy the option. Click the down arrow on copy from this account book to select the existing account book. Tick checkbox of blank account book to create an empty account book. After confirm the selection, click finish to complete create account book. Create account book window will appear, it shows the account book details. Click OK to proceed. When this prompt is appeared, means the account book is created. Now continue to another scenario. The auto count has no linkage to any database yet. This first time manage account book window will appear. In this window, you are able to select create a new account book, attach an existing account book, restore an account book, and install a sample account book. Click next to start create an account book. The steps are the same with create new account book with an existing account book. That's all for this video. Have a nice day and see you next time.